appreciate everybody coming out and participating. Uh, I promise you it's going to be well worth it. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, we've got a lot of really neat things uh, planned out, surprises, or whatever you want to call it, uh, this afternoon. Um, I want to briefly uh, uh, go over some of my expectations for the day, uh, give you the schedule, and then I'm going to introduce everybody to uh, the Colonel Oakman, who's Alabama Wing Commander. Um, first and foremost, uh, safety is our number one priority. Uh, I saw on my, uh, on my registration packet, one of those rules uh, that's not allowed is a bad attitude. All right, so uh, no bad attitudes at all. All right, if you don't think you're doing good, whoops. Please silence all cell phones. Yeah, see, how rude. <laughs> I just hung up on my wife. You'll play later. Um, no bad attitudes, have a good time out here. Uh, number two, I want to keep this a no salute zone. No salute zone. Uh, we're, there's too many officers and cadets and stuff like that. It'll get fairly annoying after about a minute. Uh, so no salute zone. Uh, second, stay with your teams at all times. Uh, if you've got to go somewhere and it's not with your team, make sure that somebody knows. Uh, I want you all to sign a leader uh, for your team. After that, uh, let's go over the schedule of events. First thing we have is going to be the Super Duper PFT, uh, and that's going to be located here all around. Uh, after that, we're going to change into BDUs, have some breakfast. Um, on the note of chow, y'all are not to be drinking caffeinated drinks today. We've got lots of water and lots of Gatorade. That's what y'all are drinking today, all right? No, no, no caffeine, no coffee. Uh, we're going to try to keep the sugars down to a minimum. Uh, we've got, we've got some, some decent chow for y'all. Um, after inspection, after morning chow, then we're going to go to the drill competition. Both of those things will be held here on these facilities. After the drill competition will be uh, the new chow. We'll have that cooked and ready to go for you. Then we'll have navigation, advanced navigation and direction finding courses located around the Auburn University. And then after that, is the run. And I'll talk about that when we get to it. Yeah, that's the most applause I've gotten in a long, long time. Thank you very much. Uh, I personally want to thank all of you for coming uh, to this event. Uh, uh, I think we have, I understand we have some folks from Mississippi. Yes, sir, right here. Back in the back, back there, huh? Well, I just, uh, I called Tim Carroll last night and told him that's, uh, that's your boss. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I just got home after being gone for like two years. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, I talked to him, I told him, I said, uh, I'm expecting big things, but we're not throwing anything for him. Uh, so anyway, welcome to Alabama and, uh, uh, and to Auburn here. How many, are, how many people are oh, let's see, that's Auburn fans? You will be up today. How many of you guys are graduates? Okay, anyway, uh, it, it's a great event. Uh, we did it, uh, they, uh, they did it last year, and it uh, turned out uh, to be uh, a, a good event that's, that uh, will probably be looked at again and again over the next few years. And hopefully it will become a national event that uh, will be uh, taking place, and it will be taking place here in Missouri. Uh, so don't go away, guys. But uh, I'm personally going to thank you guys for coming out here. Keep it up, keep it up, stay up. Keep it up, good job. Good job. Stay up, stay up, Come on. keep it up. Stay right, up. up. You gotta get some more. Go. Keep it up. Come on. Come on. You can do Come it. Up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Three. Go. Four. All the way down. Five. Six. Push it. Hold it. Keep it up. Good job. Good job. Look at Good look at all those leaves. Alright, ready? Go. Come on, 
Sorts of counter columns, oblique, oblique, all that stuff. Ca counter columns, that's fine. That's yeah, actually one. But I'm talking like uh, scatter march. Uh, like if, you're, if you're about to get hit, you can't just call scatter oh. no, and then come back in. That don't work. It, it's very innovative, but it ain't gonna get it. Uh, now, the objective of tank is to T bone another team. That's how you knock them out. All right. So, I mean, you can do flanks, columns, whatever you got to do, 200 marches. You know, if you got a team, you got a team coming up behind you, and you're walking this way, man, hit two, hit 200 marches, and bam, nail them. All right. In that, in that sense, uh, if you call a command and y'all jack up, your team gets jacked up. All right, one of my guys is going to call you on it. He's going to tell y'all to get back into formation, and y'all going to sit there for five seconds, sitting ducks. All right, so you may not be out if you lose it, but uh, it's, it's an easy target. I think everybody will gun for you when they start hearing countdowns, all right? Yeah. Are there any questions on this? Start when we 
begin here. The three teams that we have starting at NAV first will report to Major Curry right here. You will be given a course card with bearings and distances. It is your job to find the compass point. The compass event is a timed event based on the combined total of each leg. Okay. So you will call and start uh, to get cleared by compass base from your start point. They will start your time at that point. You find the first compass point. Okay, the compass points are eight and a half sheets of cardstock. They're yellow that has uh, CAP Iron Man competition. It's very self-explanatory what it is. When you find the first point, you must stop. You must call in to Compass Base and relay that point. Compass Base will also ask you for a code number, which is on the bottom of each compass sheet. Okay, this will prevent you guys from cheating, since all the compass points will be over the radio. He will ask you for a code, uh, code number that's at the bottom of the sheet. Once you give him the correct code number, he will clear you to your next point. DF will be on the south side of campus. Uh, Captain Smith will take the DF team to the south side of campus to start the start point. There will be a staggered start there. The teams will start in five minute intervals. You have about 55 minutes to complete the DF course. Okay, it's not that difficult. You should be able to find it well before that time is up. He will start you and record your start time. When you find the beacon, this is a little different from what we did last year. When you find the beacon, there are eight different yellow cards on top of the beacon. You need to take one of those cards and walk away. Don't stand around the beacon. Just take one of those cards and walk away. On those cards is information. It's the information that we would normally report back to an IC or Grand Branch Director once we find either a distress or a non more importantly, a non-distress find. That would be a beacon type, battery expiration, switch settings, serial number, make model, those types of things. For bonus points, you radio back to DF base in proper radio protocol, relay back the information that's on the card. DF base will assign bonus points that will be taken away from your total DF time if you relay all that information back correctly for the task guide. That would be task 0303. Okay? Are there any? safety issues. Granted, the university is not in session right now, so it's pretty much a ghost town. 
does not mean that you don't have to sit and watch and look for traffic. All right? Teams, teams are to stay within arm's length of each other. If you get caught out of arm's length, you're going to get penalized. Trust me, I have people all over the place. Yes, I'm looking at you. <laughs> we have an eye in the sky. Yeah. Yes. So, keep together. Um, if they, this is a run slash walk course. It's not meant for you to run the entire thing. All right. If somebody is falling behind, you gotta stay with them. It's a team event. Cool. Oh. All right. Um, Mr. Morris will be giving you the uh, the run maps. Uh, when you come up on a station, you'll see it. There will be people there. There will be some of my guys out there. Um, do what they say. Do it with a smile on your face. Uh, especially on one on one of the uh, on one of the stops. <laughs> do it with a smile on your face. Um, yeah, something like that in North nature. Um, if there are any questions, everybody, every team should still have this icon radio. Every team still have the radio. Yes? Okay. All right. If you have a safety issue, if you need medical, use this radio. Call. Not Pat, not we guys. Just try, just try. This side of that one box. You got to get across. Using all of your team members, you all of your team members across. Get into those points. Got one great to the cross, but um, somebody has to be touching each point. You get this cross. You get this point. You get across. Everybody has to go across. Um, yeah, I think point to point, somebody always has to be touching it. Okay. And then you have to end with the points. Uh, you follow all the way up here when you're around the side of it. You have to follow the way. Okay. I know, but if we're holding the board, it's going to be like the other side. As long as you're on a plank, you have to be standing on top of the plank. Oh, so we got to walk on top of it? Yes. Walk on top of it. What about oh. this? This is just a marker. You can use this as a kit. So you're aiming for the bullseye, but if you get pavement, you get... Okay. Come on. I didn't touch anything. You guys ready? 
Alright, Alright, back it up. You're good. You guys are going to start back now. You touch the road behind you. She got it. <laughs> Once you get to once you get to the end of the tree, you drop down and then go army crawl under that. Come back, black jacket. And then that's what you do. Get up, get up. Go. 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 Spread them out from each other. Okay. Wait, wait. Oh, gonna shoot what are you doing? Do do? Take the key out. Hold it down, hold it down, hold it down, hold it down. Actual time, stop. Yeah, yeah. Yes, this is a fun event for my squadron to put on. I don't know if they're going to say that right now, but but probably uh, next week they'll probably say it was a lot of fun for them. Um, but uh, if y'all are Auburn, where y'all at, Auburn? Oh! All right. Hey, let's give them a handle fast. <laughs> Alright, secondly, the guys and gals that uh, either brought y'all here, senior members that uh, took the time and their, uh, I guess their work day, I guess on Friday for some of y'all, um, and then uh, Colonel Hoskins and uh, Colonel Oakman, let's give them a round of applause for the board. Alright, let's get this thing, let's get this thing rolling. All right, first thing we're going to do is I'm going to give out, uh, we've got an award for the five graded events um, for the winners of those events. Now we've got a little trophy for y'all, so uh, if y'all come up here and uh, grab these for the Super Duper PFT. Pocket Elmore. Pictures here? Yes, we are. All right. Where's the rest of the squad? All right. Where's the rest of the squad? All right. Congratulations, guys. Inspection. Talk to Elmore. Get back up here. Both. 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 Drill competition. Let's talk a little more. You might want to right back up. <laughs> you might have got your I'm going to angle him over. I just like them to make the, make the wall. Girl, can you come in some? Thank you. Yeah. All right, guys. Smile like you mean it. Bessemer, where y'all at? Woo! Actually, it's Bessemer slash Chilton yeah, with the good. injury. Yeah. So, good to go, guys. Alright, uh, next was the actual run. I'm going to go over this stuff, and, uh, and I'll tell you all who, who wins a little bit. Just give you all an idea of the times. Maxwell completed the run, 2 hours, 26 minutes. Mississippi, one hour fifty-eight minutes. Pell City, two hours forty-four minutes. Bessemer, two hours six uh, two hours six minutes. Talking Elmore, two hours twenty-nine minutes. We had a couple of team separation penalties. I told you I had people out there watching. We also had uh, a couple of uh, failed events and some other things. Missed test questions. Uh, I'll just go ahead and knock on this one. Hey. 
I started studying. <laughs> it, was, it was ugly. I had to go through about five pins, red pins, grade those. Um, but what all that did was it added a lot of time to the end of your scores. Um, at the end, the total times after all those additions, which were horrendous, we had times of 354, 445, 356, 529, and 455. Yeah, that was a lot of addition. I didn't appreciate that. Get it to my guys. Mississippi. Let's get up here. We all want to run. We've all done this before. <laughs> Overall scores. Um, now, if you remember on the registration packet, I said uh, we're giving bonus points for females and senior members to be on the team, right? Uh, all right. If you had brought at least two females on the team and a senior member, you actually ended up with an entire extra event score. All right? Counts a lot. Overall scores were as follows without the names. 16, 17, 19, 20, 21. In third place, we had uh, the composite squadron, composite team, best of our children, Jeff. Here. Second place overall, with a score of 20 at the end of the day, Target Elmore. Get yeah. up here. <laughs> Calling it back from the front. First place overall. <laughs> With a score of 21, we get to take home this behemoth, awesome trophy, traveling trophy. Also get medallions and commander's commendations. What does a traveling trophy mean? Traveling trophy means that Mississippi needs to bring it back next year. Yes! Rebel and a bulldog. Right? Yeah, exactly. What <laughs> 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 we got to do, guys? We got to match names. Rebel, bulldog. 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 Rebel, has done outstanding job putting some of this stuff together. Um, would senior member Boris, see even he might be still up trying to get stuff taken care of. Uh, could somebody run up and grab senior member Boris? He's up. Get up here. 
photographic. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> and uh, Mr. Flash. Yeah. Regardless of what uh, of what we throw at them, they're always helpful whether or not it's this particular event or about the three or four others that we do in a year. These guys are always here, and as soon as Mr. Morris wakes up, I guess, he's, he's been up for a long time. He's somewhere. I'm going to go blow that horn. Which, uh, it, it, it really is a pleasure to really, really, really be the wing commander and those times come when we have these kind of activities, and we all get together and have a fellowship uh, within our within our own wing. And we also uh, have been very fortunate and, and are very pleased to to have you guys from uh, Mississippi over. Thank you for coming and participating. It, I know I understand a three-hour drive turned into about six or seven hours, but nine and a half hours. I'm sorry, so you're. Thank you for coming. Uh, but there's there are times when the commander uh, is looking for and, and looks for those individuals that have outstanding uh, character and, and integrity and all the things that that uh, make up what it what what we need for uh, this our program, the Civil Air Patrol. Uh, the integrity and the uh, respect and responsibilities that go along. So, uh, in the tradition of the uh, of the military, each commander uh, has a coin, and that coin represents uh, all those things. And, and here in Alabama, we have our commander's coin as well. And it, on this side here, it basically says uh, integrity, respect. Uh, excellence and volunteer service. You all fit that bill. I'm sure that as time goes on, you'll spend a few more years in, in the Civil Air Patrol and do it. But the commander, as a commander, uh, we get to give these things to people who have done these outstanding jobs. So I'd like to take this opportunity to give each one of you my coin. Uh, and uh, thank you for your volunteerism, and thank you for all the things that you have done to make this a, a uh, great event and an event and an event for the future. Thank you. All right. Uh, once again, thank you for everybody coming out. Uh, I think you're rather hungry, tired, and stinky. Uh, so, sorry to those who have to actually drive them back. My bad. Um, but, uh, once again, yes, like I said, thank you very much for coming out. Um, for Hoskins, for Oakman, thank you very much for coming out and supporting the event, as always. Uh, and, uh, get out of here. Good job, guys. Hey, if you're from the Alabama wing and didn't get a newsletter yet, come see me in the band. Alright, I'm gonna do it for the next one. Hey, whoa, 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 hold up, 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 hold up